Average Guy Air Guns here again with another session of shooting critters in the backyard. Warning, this video contains images of animals being legally shot with air rifles. This video is not intended to sensationalize the killing of animals. This video is intended to show you the effectiveness of air rifles as pest control and hunting tools. Any slow motion video is intended to prove the accuracy of the rifles I use and to show where proper shot placement should be. There is a link in the description to show why animals flop around after a brain shot. These animals were dead before they hit the ground. If you don't like this sort of video, then please do not watch it. I'm going to address a comment that I get hundreds and hundreds of times. That comment is, if you didn't bait, there wouldn't be squirrels in your yard. At the time I took these videos, I hadn't put bait out in over a month. The only reason why I do bait is because I have neighbors next door and I can't fling pellets around in any direction. I put the bait in front of a safe pellet stop. See, no bait and I still have squirrels. For this video, I'll be using my 22 caliber Benjamin Marauder. It's Huma regulated and it has a Marmot Militia Hammerforge barrel, which is now Wicked Air Rifles. It has a Hawk Sidewinder 30SF 6 24 by 56 scope, and I'll be shooting the JSB Hades pellets at 27 foot pounds energy. We'll start things off by showing you how accurate these pellets are in my rifle at 30 yards. Keep in mind when I did this 10 shot group that it was raining a little bit. Slightly under a half inch group at 30 yards. Yeah, it's good enough to smack some squirrels. I ended up getting some free wood from one of my neighbors, and it ended up being a chipmunk heaven. I apologize for how wobbly it is. I was using my tripod, and it's not the most stable platform to shoot from. After the first couple shots, I stopped using it. I can see the comments now. If you would have hurried up, you wouldn't have missed them. Or, you should have shot the rabbit. Well, at the time of this video, it wasn't small game season yet. And yes, I like to take my time. This will be the last shot from my Caldwell field pod. I'm not going to use it anymore to film because when I have the camera on it's just too unstable to shoot. By the time I hooked my phone into my scope cam, the chipmunk had disappeared on this shot. But I stuck with it, and as you can see, I ended up getting him. Fast forward a few weeks. To the opening day of small game season. The squirrels in my neighborhood have had free reign for too long. Yeah, I'd say these Hades pellets are accurate enough in my rifle at 30 yards.
Here we see the beauty of shooting suppressed air rifles. This guy didn't even flinch when I shot the chipmunk. So before I get another comment about taking too long, I had to get it into focus first before I took the shot. Here's a valuable lesson of knowing your holdovers at different distances. That'll do it for this video. As always, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. You can always follow me on Facebook to find out all the behind-the-scenes stuff that I do.